Jeremiah's Scroll Based on Jeremiah 36 God sent a message to a prophet named Jeremiah. His message was this, Take a scroll and write on it all the words that I have spoken to you against Israel and Judah and all the nations, from the day I spoke to you, from the days of Josiah until today. Maybe when I warn them about all of the bad things that will happen, they will stop doing what is evil. Then I can forgive their sin and the wrong things that they have done. Jeremiah called a man named Baruch to help him write God's message on a scroll. He told Baruch to go and to read the scroll to all the people in the temple and to all the people of Judah. Jeremiah told Baruch, Maybe once the people hear God's message, they will stop doing what is evil and ask God for forgiveness before it's too late. For these evil things they are doing have made the Lord very angry. So Baruch went and read the scroll to the people. One of the men who heard Baruch read the scroll went to the king's house to talk to all of the leaders. He told them all the words that were in the scroll. When they heard this, the leader sent for Baruch. Baruch came and read the scroll to them. When they heard all the words, they turned to one another in fear. They said to Baruch, We must tell the king what is in the scroll. When they learned the words were from Jeremiah, they told Baruch, You and Jeremiah must go hide. Let no one know where you are. Then the leaders went to the king and told him what was in the scroll. The king sent one of his men to get the scroll and to read it. The king was sitting in the winter house, and there was a fire burning in the fire pot in front of him. As the scroll was being read to him, the king took a knife and cut the words out of the scroll and threw them into the fire until the entire scroll was burned and gone. The king and his servants were not afraid of God's message in the scroll. Even when the leaders warned the king not to burn the words, he did not listen to them. The king commanded his men to capture Baruch and Jeremiah, but God kept them safe and hidden. Now after the king had burned the scroll, God sent another message to Jeremiah and said, Take another scroll and write on it all of the words that were in the first scroll, which the king of Judah has burned. Also, give the king this message. You have burned my scroll and have disregarded my message to you. Because you have done this, your family will no longer rule over Judah. You, your family, and the people of Judah will suffer the consequences because they did not listen to my warnings or stop doing what is evil. So Jeremiah obeyed God and took another scroll and gave it to Baruch to write down all that the Lord had said.